This is Living Power with Dan Hurst. The criteria for salvation, by the way, uh, is that one submits to a relationship with Jesus Christ in which God is given complete control of one's life. That's what salvation is. When the Bible talks about salvation, what it's saying is that you give God complete control of your life. None of this idea that, oh, well, I went forward and I joined the church and I got baptized, that's not salvation. Salvation is when you give your life to Christ and He becomes Lord of your life. You see, Jesus died to be your Savior, but He rose to be your Lord. And He wants to be Lord of your life. There is nowhere in the Bible where Jesus is given the, re the responsibility or given the right to be your Savior without being your Lord. Lordship is where salvation comes from. Jesus is mentioned as Savior 11 times in the Bible. Count them, 11 times. But He's mentioned as Lord over 700. Where do you think the weight is? It's on the Lordship of Christ because as Lord, He is Savior. And so when you become saved, when you get saved, when, you, when, when salvation comes into your life, it's because you have given Him His rightful place of Lord of your life. It's salvation on God's terms, not your terms. God says, I'll save you, but I'm going to be your Lord. I have to be your Lord to be your Savior. And those are His terms for salvation. You give Him the position of Lord of your life, and you become His servant. Now, we will rebel against that every once in a while in life, sometimes often. But we have still given Him the right to be Lord and the authority, the supreme and absolute authority of our life. And He invokes that. Have you denied Christ that position in your life? Have you taken back, in other words, control and refused to let Him be who He is in your life? That's what Peter was doing. He wasn't letting Jesus be who He is in his life. He denied Him. And when you don't let Jesus be Lord of your life, you are denying Him. On behalf of Dan Hurst and the Open Class, we want to thank you for watching. We hope it was a blessing.